One, installation and adjustment. The user should first open the wrapping wooden box and then fit the machine on the plain and the tight floor. Adjust the machine to the water level through the adjusting bolts on the machine anchor. Open the panel box and connect the power cable to the nodes denoted with A, B, and C respectively and connect the yellow line to the end node. Then, connect the earthing according to the earthing node. Start the machine with the starting handle to check whether the machine runs properly. Open the key switch and the emergency stop switch. Push the green button and switch on all the switches and the temperature controller, then starting heating. Put the film-shaped paper on the paper rack with the laminated film facing upwards. Adjust the position of the paper feeding roller and the positioner roller. Keep the shaped paper tube on the cone-shaped die. The clearance between the paper tube bottom and the cone-shaped die bottom shall be the depth of two finished products. Add the finimesial silicone oil, and then adjust the height and oil level in the oil tank. Fit the paper with the laminated paper facing upwards through the paper frame and the die frame. Turn the paper feeding direction for prompt feed. Adjust the distance between the upper shaft central point to make a clearance for two cup bottoms. Turn the swing or the lifting shaft for proper lift. Turn the eccentric wheel or the die for proper lift. Make the lifting shaft 6 to 8 mm deeper into the delivery ring if you feel. Adjust the position of the 8 delivery ring and the lifting shafts. Adjust the pressing bottom line on the center of the delivery ring from the components. Adjust the height of the pressing components and put the bottom paper on the position of finished products in the paper tube. Adjust the central position of the ejection piece to the tree. The paper should right cover the cone shape die and the bottom paper should not wrinkle. Using the four fastening bolts on the light wheel and the connecting flange. Adjust the concentric points of the 8 cone shaped die and the nearing heating seats and the height. Adjust the bolt of the nearing wheel so that the pressure matches the nearing wheel. Adjust the concentric points of the flange furnace and the cone shape and the height of the flange furnace. To the paper tube to the furnace with the paper tube and 9 mm higher than the flange plate. When the pressure roller reaches the lowest point, the flange plate will be pressed downward 2 to 3 mm. 
When the pressure roller reaches the lowest point, the upper flange scraper is 1 mm to the cone-shaped die. A second plate will reach 2 to 3 mm to the cup bottom. Just the concentric points of the preheating furnace and the cone-shaped die and the height. Just the concentric points of the bottom die turn over and the cone-shaped die and the height. Adjust the ejecting piece to the center of the tree, the height, so that the finished products can be properly transferred to the receiver. If the wheel does not move, then the swing of the finished products, so that the lifting time and ejecting time for the finished products match. By then, the adjustment is finished and the machine can be started. All the procedures are closely related, and the procedures cannot be misplaced. During production, tighten the bolts and the nuts regularly. 2. The normal operation of the unit includes A, B, and C separation. A. Sealing B. Bottom cutting C. Forming Tell procedures Sealing a second plate takes the fan shaped paper from the paper frame and put it on the guiding reel. The feeder roller transfers the fan shaped paper to the positioner roller. The left and the right hinge holds the fan shaped paper to the die head tightly. The copper stick presses the welding, and the left and right hinge separates. The catcher draws the finished paper tube out. Bottom cutting. The bottom paper moves to the position, the lower scraper moves to the highest position and cuts the bottom paper. Then, it's put into the delivery ring by the lifting bearing. The ejected component sucks the bottom paper on the delivery ring to the lowest position and release the pressure. Forming File Procedures 1. Preheating 2. Bottom Turnover 3. Kneeling 4. French 5. Release Preheating is to melt the laminated film on the forming paper tube bottom. Bottom turnover is to shape the forming paper tube bottom and melt the laminated film. Kneeling is to melt laminated film on the forming paper tube bottom and form the cup. Note, if the kneeling pressure is too low, the cup bottom will turn yellow or leak when the temperature is too low or too high. When flanging, the upper flange die is pressed down by the pressure roller and reaches the lower flange plate. At the same time, the central extension shaft and the lower die are pressed downwards. The lower washer will separate 1 to 1.5 mm. Release. The pressure panel will release the pressure when pressing downwards. The lower sucking panel intakes the pressure and puts the finished cup to the tree. 3. Fillers and Solutions Cohesion Filler 1. The fan-shaped paper is not sucked or springs back. 2. The sealing cohesion is not tight enough. 3. The paper tube is not even. 4. The paper tube is not drawn out. If the fan shaped paper is not sucked or springs back, so the problem is follows. When the sucking plate reaches the fan shaped paper, turn the sucking cylinders to the central position. Lower the sucking plate to 15 mm to the lower panel and turn the sucking release camshaft to release the pressure in the control wall. When the fan shaped paper is sucked to the guiding reel and transferred to the positional roller by the delivery roller, the fan shaped paper will tightly held on the die head with right hand drill faster than the left one. If the sealing cohesion is not tight enough, it's closely related to the weight, size, and the cohesive. 
temperature of the laminated paper by different suppliers. According to the forming effects of the paper tube, just the temperature through the temperature controller. Note, the cohesion is not desirable if the temperature is too low, resulting in the cup spring back. The paper will turn yellow if the temperature is too high or the paper and the PE film separates. If the paper tube is not evenly glued, adjust the position of the paper feeder roller and the positional roller. If the spring ejector breaks, the problems may also occur. Please change with new ones. The distance between ejection piece and the die head is about 4 to 5 mm. If the paper tube is not drawn out, the temperature is so high that the laminated film sticks on the die head after melting or too much water is spread on the fan shaped paper so that the paper edges and fills to be drawn out. Bottom filler. 1. The bottom paper divides. 2. One side is wider than the other side when French. 3. It turns around when pressed into the paper tube. Adjust the pressure boards on the left and the right supporting plates of the adjusting roller if the bottom paper divides. One side is wider than the other side when flanging. Please solve the problems as follows. If the cutting roller die does not cut the paper entirely and the lifting axis ejected cup bottom, in this case, slightly turns the lift axis counterclockwise or turns the eccentric wheel clockwise slightly. Note, observe when the bottom paper stops, choose one to adjust. Other cause might be the overwear or the lower and upper die. In this case, sharpen the scraper or change with new ones. It turns around when pressed into the paper tube. For second place, don't hold the cup bottom or in an over long time. The cup bottom is pulled up when it reaches position. In this case, when the ejected components reach the delivery ring, turn the sucking cylinder to the central position. When the ejected components are pressed to 15 mm to the cut bottom, turn the release can shaft to release the pressure in the control wall. Forming failure 1. Paper feeding roller and the catcher roller stays in proper position. 2. One side is wider than the other after downward overturn. 3. The cup bottom contacts improperly with leakage after nearing forming. 4. One side is deeper than the other side is red after nearing forming. 5. The flanged edge release of the cup is not flanged properly. 6. The cup wrinkles. 7. The finished cups fail to leave the line. If the paper feeding roller and the catcher roller stays in proper position, so the problem is as follows. When the hinge starts moving, turn the paper feeder roller swing counterclockwise so that the paper feeder roller keeps straight to 10 mm to the final point. When the welding copper stick separates 2 to 3 mm, the paper pickup roller will catch the finished paper tube. If one side is wider than the other after downward overturn or the cup bottom overturns too much or less. So the problem is as follows. Adjust the concentric point of the bottom turnover and the cone shape die and the turnover die height. Note, the failure is directly related to the fact that if the forming paper tube is too large or too small. If in this case, 
adjust the position of the paper feed roller and the position and roller at the ceiling section. If one side is deeper than the other side, it is thread after the near ring forming, please solve the problems as follows. Adjust the concentric point of the near ring furnace and the cone shape die. If the inner bearing or the near ring wheel breaks, change with a new one. If the cup bottom contacts improperly with leakage of the near ring forming, solve the problem as follows. The filler usually is caused by improper temperature, improper pressure of the near ring wheel, or the improper height of the near ring wheel. Turn the near ring wheel clockwise to lower the height. Adjust the M to wheel, hexagon, bolts, directory, and the near ring wheel, losing the nut, and turn the bolts. If clockwise, you are increasing the pressure. If counterclockwise, you are decreasing the pressure. Adjust the bolt slightly to avoid too much pressure difference. Push the core responsive button on the temperature controller to adjust the temperature. If the French edge release of the cup is not French properly, please solve the problem as follows. If the central extension bearing spring pressure is too low, or the pressing roller may overpress. Turn the nearing furnace counterclockwise or put a washer between the extension bearing of the washer. In other case, if the cup is not flanged properly, the French pressure roller may not work properly. Adjust the height of the French pressure roller. If it's due to the diameter of the forming paper tube is too small, please adjust the position of the paper feeder roller and the position and roller. If the cup wrinkles, please solve the problem as follows. Usually, if the French pressure roller Press is too much, the problem will occur. Adjust the height of the French pressure roller. If finimation silicone oil is not properly added, the problem may also occur. In this case, add finimation silicone oil to the oil tank. If the French panel lower springs is over tight, change with four new ones with smaller tension. If the cone shaped die and the French lower die, are not in central position, just the central position of the flange furnace and the cone shape die. The above form may cause the problem of full wrinkle or release. If the finished cups fail to leave the line, solve the problem as follows. Adjust the pressure loader to the lowest point. The upper flange die proper is 1 mm to the cone shape die. The second plate is 3 to 5 mm to the cup bottom. Adjust the release cylinder. Key failure. If the three wheel stays in the wrong position, solve the problem as follows. Turn the machine with the handle to make the nearing wheel bearing stays at the central position of the auxiliary camshaft. Adjust the central position of the medium sized and the small wheel. The swing of the finished products. Turn the handle conquer clockwise after the fed components is going to leave. When the three wheels stop, the fed nylon components will be lowered to the delivery ring at the height of 60mm. Then tighten and finish the product swing bolt. 4. Electrical failures and solutions 1. Heating failure Check whether the circuit brake chips, the contact works properly, the connecting nodes contact properly, and the heating pipe keeps in good condition. If necessary, please change with new components accordingly. 2. Improper display of the temperature. Change with new thermal coupling and heating pipe. 3. Temperature controller failure. The thermal coupling and the heating pipe work properly, but the temperature controller fails. Change with new temperature controller. The unit is highly automated. 
Therefore, we are unable to list all the failures. If necessary, please read through the schematic wiring diagram. 5. Maintenance The maintenance includes cleaning, lubricating, tightening and loosening, the tension of the transmission chain and tightening the bolts. Please carry out the maintenance according to the user manual. The user should grasp the operating techniques from the application, and your suggestions and opinions are welcome. 6. The procedures are changing the die with same bottom and cone. Losing the four spring column bolts on the flanged panel. Remove the flanged panel and the spring column. Losing the upper cover bolts. Remove the upper cover. Losing the lower die connecting bolts on the flanged panel. And remove the lower die on the flanged panel. 8 central bolts for connecting the flange on the large wheel and change the 8 groups of forming die. Install the new flange lower die up cover, flanged panel, and four spring column bolts. Seven. The procedures for changing the die with different bottom and cone. Losing the forming die head and the beam connecting bolts, remove the forming die head. Install the forming die head when the distance between the forming die head bottom and the panel is within 4 to 5 mm. Remove the central panel. Remove the left and the right welded hinges axis and install the two unwelded hinge axes. The right hinge should be faster than the left one by 1 to 1.5 mm. Weld the hinge and the hinge axis. When the distance between the hinge and the hinge roller is within 1.5 to 2 mm, weld the hinge and the hinge ring. Change the 8 nylon chase on the medium sized wheel. Change the 2 nylon piece. And the change the finished receiver. Remove the small wheel and loosen the die cut connecting roller and the roller boards. Change the paper release plate and upper the lower die cut and install accordingly. The lower die cut will enter the upper die when you draw upward and moving plate. Tighten the two bolts on the upper die, loosen the moving plate and push it slightly, respect it 3 to 4 times. Then the lower die cut will enter the upper die cut. Tighten the four bolts on the upper die cut. Change the upper piece of the lifting shaft. The eight delivery rings on the small wheel and the nylon rejected parts. Change the preheating cap, the turnover die, nearing heating seat, and the nearing wheel. Some parts should be changed the same as die with same bottom and cone.